Hello, it's Feedback Gaming here. You might know me from such videos such as Top 10 Worst Starts in Hearts of Iron 4, Top Division Templates, and uh, How to Go Through the Maginot Line. My channel has gone through an identity crisis. What content does Feedback Gaming make? Is he the Top 10 guy? Is he the Tutorial guy? Or is it Let's Plays? Well, I don't know either. So, I need you guys to tell me what kind of content you prefer. What I've done is I've categorized all my video types into different colors so they're more easy to identify. We have blue non-edited Let's Plays. We have red, which is edited Let's Plays. We have green, which are cheats, guides, and glitches. We have orange, which is dev diaries. We have yellow, which are top 10s, top 5 videos. Purple, which are comedy videos. I will leave a straw poll at the bottom of the video. I need you guys to vote on it and tell me what kind of content that you do prefer. This will tell me what direction the channel will take. Over time, I more than likely will eliminate different kinds of video types and trying to unify my channel under one certain color and one certain content. More than likely whatever does best on my channel. Have I told you about Patreon? I've simplified the Patreon tiers. Uh, now there's only two. There's Become a Feedbacker, which gets you a uh, golden name on Discord, multiplayer priority access. And there's also a gold feedbacker, which gets you access to all my other social media, as well as make suggestions in future for future content. Now when I upload new series, long let's plays, I will attempt to upload them and leave them unlisted and then publish them one video per day like I normally do. But now the difference is now they're unlisted, you can just click on the playlist and you can watch the whole series in one sitting, well if you choose to. Can't guarantee that I'll always be able to do that. Sometimes if I want to rush out lots of content because there's some kind of deadline, then there might be some videos missing. But I'll always try and fill out the playlist as quickly as possible. This also means that the scheduling might be a little bit different when I publish videos too. I always try to schedule my videos and make them go live in subscription boxes around about 8 p.m. GMT. And if I have two series running at the same time, one will go live at 8 p.m. and one at 9 p.m. A little brief Q&A. First of all, will we be seeing more edited content on your YouTube channel? Yes. Uh, not only have I got uh, Marconi to edit a few videos for me, but I will be doing some more editing as well. That will probably be the evolution of my channel and that's the direction I'll probably be going. When will you play Hearts of Iron 3? Hearts of Iron 2 is nostalgic for me because that's one of the first Paradox games I've played. Unfortunately, Hearts of Iron 3 doesn't appeal to me. I played Hearts of Iron 3, I think I played it for about 10 hours, and it, it just isn't my game. I, I gave it a good go, but I'm just not going to be playing it on my channel. What's happened to the Hearts of Iron 4 content, Dave? Uh, okay, so Wiki the Tiger is only a few weeks away, so I thought I'd go for just a very temporary, the smallest possible break of a few weeks of not having Hearts of Iron 4 content. I'm really tempted to play a lot of mods, but I'm really interested to see how those mods are going to evolve when Waking the Tiger comes out. And I think this is probably going to be the biggest release when it comes down to the base game and also the evolution of mods as well. So yes, there'll be more mods. And yes, Hearts of Iron 4 is coming back, okay? Just wait for Waking the Tiger. It's just around the corner. Just a few weeks. You can wait. And finally, join my Discord, subscribe to my second channel, and give me money.